When you're doing digital marketing, whether for your own business or your clients, you need actionable insights and data available at your fingertips. It's for this reason that we did something insane and created SERPT, an all-in-one tool suite that consists of pretty much every tool you'll need to carry out your digital marketing and SEO campaigns. Even if you only end up using two or three of these tools in your or your client's business, you'll derive massive value from the SERPT suite of tools. From site management to rank tracking, in-depth rank tracking, including YouTube trackers and Amazon trackers if you need them, to client acquisition tools, domain finding tools, SEO analysis tools, and obviously keyword research tools. You can then go further and use our social exchanger, which allows you and other members to team up and leverage efforts in order to get massive actions taken. This works on a credit system. You or your team members can perform certain actions, which earns credits, and then you can request other actions by other team members. It's a very interesting tool. Of course, we have other tools as well, including Content Restorer from any site. You can pull back all the content and download it as a zip file and upload it to your hosting and link indexing tools. Under domain finding, we have the creme de la creme of expiring domains in the next 72 hours. We have an expired scraper where you can, you can go out and scrape sites to find domains that you can register. Auction Master, which scans a bunch of auction sites and pulls back their SEO metrics so that you can make your decisions not only based on revenue, but also if you're just looking for a valuable domain. And Exact Match Domains allows you to hack different names and terms and build a great list of available domains that you can register at any registrar that contains search volume. Let's jump into the Site Manager. From Site Manager, this is where you manage your sites. As well as getting an overview of all the metrics and all your site stats, you can manage the actual site from here, including adding in all your keywords, seeing all your authority scores, and you can view them over time by clicking on them. This is gonna load a chart over time. You can view different metrics over time in a graph, and you can print out these charts or download them. You can also see the same for your competitors. You can add your inner pages, you can monitor them and sort them by any metric you want. And you can see how you compare to your competitors. Inside Backlinks Manager, you can monitor all of your backlinks. Anytime you build a backlink, you can put it inside of Backlinks Manager. And from here, you'll be able to monitor which ones are active, which ones become not found, and which ones have site problems. You can see your indexed and your not indexed domains. This is very important if you're paying for backlinks and you want to monitor them and make sure that they're still there, because if you've paid for a lifetime link and then it becomes inactive, you can get a notification and then you can contact that person and ask them to reactivate it. You can use tagging systems to sort for them at any stage, and then you can go further and check your real anchor text breakdown. You can check the breakdowns of page authority and domain authority of your backlinks, as well as charting. And you can see the breakdowns of your C and B class referring IPs. Another thing you can do with our tables is you can include and exclude columns. So ones that are once important to you, you can simply remove them from the table. It's very easy to switch between your different projects here. You can easily check any domain you want by simply pasting it in here and then clicking Analyze. And that's gonna go and it's gonna launch the most comprehensive site explorer available online. The reason is it compares multiple services and shows you using a color code which version of the site is stronger. As we know, Google uses subdomains as different domains. So if you were to buy a domain, an expired domain, for example, that you wanted to rebuild, this would show you which version is the strongest to rebuild it on and you can see both with and without www, so both the subdomain and the main domain. You can see the total number of backlinks, and you can see the different topical trust flows as well as the spam score. On the left menu, you can dig in and you can view the backlinks, and once again, choose what columns to include or exclude, search by backlink, filter by minimum citation flow, trust flow, and backlink type, and then export all those filtered results to CSV. We also go very in depth into the backlinks so you can see the countries and the TLD breakdowns. You can see where the majority of the backlinks come from. You can see the industries and types. You can see the age of the backlinks. 
so how old and how long they've had those backlinks for. A nice link velocity chart as well, so that you can see whether the site is getting more or less links closer to our current date. And you can see a trust flow breakdown of the different backlinks and where they sit. You can also dig into the anchor text, including the, the anchor languages. You can see the domain's history, how long it's been registered for, who registered it, some screenshots and way back versions, and top pages as well. This will show you the pages with the best page authority rated first. And we can also check out its rankings in what ranks where. So by clicking that, it'll take us here. We can choose, let's say we want to see 75 top results sorted by the highest traffic percentage. This then pulls back the keywords sorted by the highest traffic percentage. It's the most amount of traffic that's coming to the site. Here you can see the estimated traffic, you can see the search volume and the rankings on the different terms. And then if you wanted to see how competitive it is to rank on a term, for example, Game of Thrones, you can click on that and it's going to analyze the top page of Google and pull in all the metrics. And then it pulls back all this exciting and useful data, including the DAs, PAs, links for each of the ranking sites. Keyword search tool as well, where you can either enter multiple keywords or come up with one keyword and build from there. You can choose where you want to search, and you can even go by state and city, broad or exact. Where you can now see keywords to get ideas for building your site. You can see the search volume trends over time. So we can see that it's been trending up as we've been getting closer to the start of the season. Get long tail keywords for this term and launch a revenue calculator to see how much money you can make based on your click-through rate. You can of course export all of these keywords. You can mark keywords as important and then have them build up into a list. You can send them to Rank Tracker for any site that you have, or you can add them to your site and site manager. Over in the Rank Tracker, we can select our site and then we can see our ranking situation. We can see where we're ranking for our different terms. We can see our rankings over time, whether they're steady or whether they're changing. So for example, if we wanted to click on this one, we could see that we've actually dropped quite a few positions recently. And then we can diagnose why and go about sorting that out. You can also obviously change the check period over there. We can go in and we can view the keyword. When looking at the keyword, we can see our ranking position. We can obviously change the time frame to any period that we like. We can see any notes, either ones that we've created or ones by the system. And you also see them on the chart here if there were any notes within the last period of time. You can see your ranking check table as a breakdown. And you can see your competitors, where they rank in comparison to you. So there you are, and then here are the competitors and where they're ranking for these terms if they're ranking at all. And you can sort by the different locales if you have multiple locales and you can sort it over a longer period of time. We have this tool called the Fantastic 13 available on certain member plans that will show you for this keyword term in Google US, we can see which sites have been ranking where for what period of time. And if we wanted to see a specific site, we just click on that one and it's going to show us the rankings of that site over the check period time, which you can obviously also extend out and it's going to analyze that site for you. So really quite powerful ways of checking. And so with that, we've only just scratched the surface of the tools and the power of the SERP.net all-in-one suite. Others such as Site Auditor Pro allow you to embed full, beautiful site audits for lead generation, as well as Citation Scanner allows you to scan any business across hundreds of directories. Prospector tools, full site reporting, including automated reporting where you can input your email address or any of your clients' email addresses and get full automated reporting on their sites. And also full team calendars, notes system, activity feeds, create tasks for any of your team members, and so much more. It may seem overwhelming, but we have video tutorials, FAQs, a wiki, and you can reach us at any time. So what are you waiting for? We're looking forward to having you with us in SERP.net. We also offer a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk in joining up and giving us a try. Looking forward to seeing you on the inside.